the United States entered World War II. The tank, which only a few short years before was considered of relatively minor importance, suddenly loomed large in our plans. With the organization of armored divisions, the long-envisioned team of combined arms. Tanks, armored infantry, armored artillery, armored engineers, and armored reconnaissance became a reality. President Roosevelt in 1942 had ordered every spare tank shipped to North Africa. Tanks were also needed in other theaters of war. The dispensing of these tanks to all parts of the world was a huge and complex task. The tank was to serve two basic roles. Separate tank battalions were to support the infantry divisions. Armor divisions were to perform independent action. German armor had performed the same two functions in its blitzkrieg through Europe. We met our obligations. These tanks, shipped from the United States to England, are tested for maneuverability before being sent out into battle.